time for a range test on that new Turbo Wing VTX. I got 25, 200, and 600 milliwatts, and I got a really big open meadow here. So I'm gonna take a counter that I stole from my work, and I'm gonna see how far I can get that Turbo Wing VTX. So I'm gonna start roughly here. There's a tree in the middle of the meadow, and the end of the meadow's way down there. So this may take a minute. Now that I've got a rough distance for my little meadow here, time to send them up. So I got the VTX hooked up into this old uh, Beagle frame drone I got. If you don't know Beagle, um, check them out. They're making some really good headway, I'm trying to make entry level drones for beginners without all the confusing soldering and beta flight and everything. So Beagle drones, check them out. But I got the Turbo Wing VTX in here, and I also have. It's not that little tiny VTX from Turbo Wing with just a little dipole, but it uses the same plug, so I threw it on this guy and see what kind of range I can get off of that little tiny dipole. The VTX shows in my goggles that it's 25, but it's really pit mode. If my goggles show 200, it's really 25 uh, milliwatts. If I see 500, it's 200. If I see 800, it's 600. It's in the manual. But it can get confusing. So right when you power this up, you might be in pit mode, even though it says 25 uh, milliwatts. So double check your power strength. I have all stock equipment, no clear view. I'm just running a TBS antenna and the standard Turbo Wing VTX. My power is coming directly from the battery. I do not have a capacitor, so I might see a little uh, fuzziness in my vision. But let's see how far I can get. So you're seeing the little lines in my vision. That's probably from the capacitor not being on my quad. Coming up to the tree. Pretty good. That's about 360. And I still have really good vision. So let's go a little farther. Right about there. So on 25 milliwatts, I can get about, I'd say a good almost 500 feet which is pretty good for 25, because uh, if you're racing on 25, that should be plenty of power to get around a race course, especially if you're using clear view. All right, so, first test worked good on 25 milliwatts. I was able to go about 500 feet. I'm gonna bump it up to 200 milliwatts, and I should be able to make it to the edge of the meadow around eight, 900 feet. Okay, let's see. Again, this tree is about 360. Just cruising kind of slow. I know I'm at uh, probably about 700 feet now, starting to lose signal. I'm just doing slow S's back and forth to increase my distance. That way I don't lose video right away. But it's working good. That road right there that you're seeing, we're good. That's 900 feet. It could probably go farther, but then I'd be flying over some houses. Well, great success so far with the Turbo Wing BTX. I was able to go all the way to the edge of the meadow, which we know is about 880, 900 feet. And I felt like I still had another couple hundred feet to go easy. Next, I'm gonna try this mini Turbo Wing VTX. It just has a simple dipole. Obviously, this thing's meant for a two inch quad or something else, but it had the same plug and I'm running Turbo Wings on my quads. So I just plugged it in, it was simple. Some double stick tape. Here we go. So let's see how good this dipole antenna works. happy with the Turbo Wing VTX. I was easily able to go 500 feet or so on the 25 milliwatts. I was able to go 
well into a thousand if I wanted to on the 200 milliwatts. They're saying I should double that range on 200 milliwatts, but I'm on stock equipment. If I had a clear view, I'm sure I could push it to probably 2,000 feet on 200 milliwatts with a clear line of sight, but who flies with a clear line of sight? I'm going to be doing a lot more reviews. I got a lot of stuff coming up. Things coming in from Tyrannus, Betaflight, more from Turbo Wing, all sorts of stuff coming up this summer. Please, please subscribe to my channel. I don't care if you uh, share and comment, but if you want to troll me and tell me how bad I suck, do that too. Any information on myself is a learning point, and I can always grow from it. So I don't care what you got to say. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Goggles down. Thumbs up.